Hi, this is Sherri Ann Richardson from experimentalhomesteader.com and welcome to our daily vlog. I wanted to start out by showing you a project that I'm working on. I uh, found this decoupage fabric at our local Joanne craft store a number of months back. It was actually an Easter clearance decoupage paper and I really loved it. So I decided that I was going to use it to redo this dresser, which I don't know if you could tell from the top of it, but it really needed a facelift. So I have put the uh, paper on. I have coated it with a coat of Mod Podge, and I'm going to seal it when I'm done. And I'm looking for some uh, different handles because I don't like the handles that was originally on this dresser. I'm going to paint the dresser, possibly the same purple as the bedroom. I haven't decided for sure yet, but I'm thinking the same purple as the bedroom. And I'm wanting to do the edges around the drawers in maybe an antique gold. Now, I don't know since I got that on discount and actually paid for it with cash if I need to give my disclaimer, but I'm going to go ahead and give it because some of the products I'm going to be talking about next, I did give for review. So I do need to tell you that the products in this video I received for free or at a reduced price in exchange for my honest review. All opinions are my own. Now, you know, I've been doing the perfect portions diet for the past 21 days. This is actually day 22. So we did, we took my weight this morning and then we did all the measurements this morning. When I started out 21 days ago, I was 156.7 pounds. Today I weighed in at 151.9. So I did lose some weight. I was 213 inches total when we started 21 days ago. Today, I was 207.5 inches. So now they measure you around your chest, your arms, your thighs, your waist. Um, and I don't remember where else we had to measure, but basically um, you take your measurements. And so I had lost a few inches in a few places and definitely lost some weight. So I'm pretty happy. I have the option to start it again, or I saw that they had another uh, weight loss, an extreme weight loss, I think it said. So, but I think I'm going to start the same one over again for another 21 days and see if we can't lose some more poundage um, because I'm trying to get down to about 125. Um, the doctor has said that I need to do this and I definitely do not want to take diabetes medicine. So the option is to lose weight and that's what we're gonna do. Um, in other news, um, we're still working on cleaning up. I don't know if my daughter's gonna come here and stay now or not. Um, she said she thinks she's just gonna wait till she can get her own place. And so I don't know, but we're gonna keep going because I'm really excited to be getting the changes made in the bathroom. Um, we have those two new faucets to put in and try, and we have the walls to finish up. Um, when we get the upstairs cleaned out, I would like to paint and do some different things up there to clean that up and make it look really nice. And eventually get to my bedroom and um, get the extra blankets and things we have sitting around in there out and maybe have a better place for our clothes because it's kind of crowded right now. The clothes rack is at the end of the bed because the room is super, super small. So I'm thinking as we make some clearance upstairs, since those are pretty well going to be guest rooms, maybe we can move some clothing and stuff up there. And oh, that's Charlie bumping. I'm um, trying to get up here and maybe have some extra storage for our clothes and i would very much like to uh have some uh storage space up there for extra blankets and stuff because you can never have too many of those so i'm going to show you the items i did get today for review um this is a ipod touch 4 case um not sure who sent it um but okay I don't even know if it will fit any of my iPods, but I guess we'll find out. Um, I got these uh, Queelink, I guess. These are gloves. And um, 
these are for welding. I do have a welder that I'm definitely looking forward to trying these out. And I'm thinking with the fire pit, these are also going to be really great just to have an extra pair on hand. I have several pairs around, but it's always good to have an extra pair because you never know when something's going to happen. Um, I also received this uh, set of 15 vacuum storage bags. And this is going to be great for all the blankets and stuff I have. It's going to make it really easy to compress those and get more storage out of the area upstairs. And also clothes that are out of season. So um, I'm having a little bit of problem with Charlie here wanting to root around up here. Um, okay, I also got this uh, tie and belt organizer. It's motorized, it goes in a closet, and I thought this would be a great way to, it actually holds 50, so ties, belts, scarves, things like that, we can put on here and have them a little more organized than the way they are right now. And I also received uh, the Swiss part. These are little uh, piping tips. So, Oh wow, they come with their own coupler and there is a reusable bag in here and I'm trying to pull the piping tips out just so we can take a better look. Um, they are really packed tight in this box so um, let me pull these out and like I said then we can take a look. This is the bag and my understanding is it is reusable. So I'll show you, oops, okay, hold on. Okay, I wanted to show you some of the different tips. Um, I really like this one. Looks like a bunch of little stars. Then we have that one. That looks like it might be a rose or something. Um, we have this one. Okay. I really love trying these cake decorating tips like this. Um, it's so much fun and you never know when you're going to need to decorate a cake. Okay, these are larger stars. Um, there we go. Okay. So, um, I will be making a video using these so you can actually see what the different tips do. And the last item is something I'm really, really excited about because I already have a bunch of these pans, but I now have a set of three of the Ozeri Green Earth pans. An 8 inch, a 10 inch, and a 12 inch. Um, I have an 8 inch, I have a 12 inch, and I also have a wok. And I can tell you they are absolutely fabulous, fabulous pans. I use them all the time. Even after the two or three years that I've had some of the pans, they are still nonstick and they are so easy to clean up. So absolutely love them. You just have to make sure you season them right. Um, I use, let's see, what did I use? I use sesame oil to season mine. I will probably use peanut oil this time, um, but you need to use a natural oil, not a synthetic when you season them the first time and then just follow the directions to take care of them and like i said they're absolutely great so with the addition of this set i'm going to be passing my old pans along my old skillets and uh because i won't need them anymore except my my cast iron i'll be keeping those but um the other ones i'll be passing on so i think that's about it for me today um i hope you've enjoyed our vlog and i hope you're enjoying some of the review videos that we're putting up and I really hope you enjoyed Olivia's birthday video because I think everybody had a really great time. The kids loved the pinata and were so excited when all the candy came out. So that was my first time seeing a pinata get busted. So it was a lot of fun. Um, and I'm so glad that everybody showed up for the party. Um, 
and everything went really great. So thanks for watching. Have a great night, and I'll see you back here tomorrow with another daily vlog.